Lack of regular exercise can kill you. Yes, we're talking about you. Do you want a heart attack? People who don't exercise on a regular basis and then have episodes of intense exercise or even sex are more likely to experience a heart attack or die suddenly than those who are more active. Why is irregular physical activity bad for you? Journal of the American Medical Association suggests that irregular bouts of physical activity can be a trigger for a heart attack or sudden death, while infrequent episodes of sexual activity increase the risk of just heart attacks. People are dropping dead. Researchers found a 3.5 times increased risk of heart attack from irregular physical activity while sex was associated with 2.7 times greater risk. Why exercise? People who exercise in one form or another several times per week experience less of an increase in risk while exercising compared to people who are not regularly active. Look at all the medical complications of obesity, diabetes, cancer, gallbladder disease, skin, gout. It goes on and on and on. Remember, exercise is the poor man's plastic surgery because it does make you look better. Sudden exertion. Sudden out-of-the-ordinary levels of exertion in the otherwise sedentary person may be associated with heart attack. Like in the case of an older person who does very little exercise, then when snow falls, they're out there shoveling. Other factors. Inactive people tend to also have other risk factors for heart disease, such as smoking and obesity. You know, we're working on the obesity. I hope you already conquered the smoking. Inactive people tend to lose their sex drive, which is not a good idea. It affects brain function, depression, and sleep. And it affects your self-esteem. Health and wellness. Not only about losing the fat, it's about being healthy and physically fit. If you turn it into a habit, which takes only 21 days, it will become a form of enjoyment and you will look forward to it. It boosts your immune system and helps prevent heart disease, type 2 diabetes, and our enemy, obesity. It helps improve mental health and avoid depression. As this says on this hat, I need a mental health day. We need one every day. Reduces stress, and stress is one of the greatest causes of why we have put on the weight. Exercise reduces levels of cortisol, which is the stress hormone that builds fat in the abdominal region, making weight loss difficult. Cortisol causes many health problems, both physical and mental. And we gave you an exercise of deep breathing when you're going to stress. You take four deep breaths through your nose and exhale through your mouth. Four beats for in and four beats out, and you'll reduce the amount of stress. Stress is what's making us fat. Here's a good one. Lose weight while you sleep. A 2010 review of published scientific research suggested that exercise generally improves sleep for most people and helps sleep disorders such as insomnia. When you don't get enough sleep, it drives leptin hormone levels down which means you don't feel as satisfied after you eat. Lack of sleep also causes ghrelin hormone levels to rise, which means your appetite is stimulated, so you want more food. And that's one of the things that causes us to be hungry all the time because we're really not getting enough sleep and rebuilding our body. Are we saying you should stop exercising and having sex? Hell no! Men of similar class and occupation had markedly different rates of heart attack depending on the level of exercise they got. The benefits of exercise is well known. What you need to do is start exercising if you're not doing it now. Of course, check with your doctor before you start any program. Then also, get your physical. Find out what your numbers are, your cholesterol, your blood pressure, your diabetes number. The doctor may ask you, which is better? Exercising one hour a day or being dead 24 hours a day? I hope you know the answer to that. What exercise is best? We like walking and biking, which are the easiest for overweight people like us. You know, when you're riding a bike, you're sitting on your butt. 
and it's not uh, working on your knees and other parts of your body, and it's the way to do a lot of exercise in a small period of time. Flexibility exercises such as stretching improve the range of motion of muscles and joints. Aerobic exercise such as cycling, swimming, walking, skipping rope, rowing, running, hiking, or playing tennis focus on increasing cardiovascular endurance, and this is something we should all strive for. Anaerobic exercises such as weight training, functional training, etc. training or sprinting increase short-term muscle strength. The thing is to do it. Physical activity must become what you do to live your new life. It can no longer be acceptable not to exercise in some form or fashion every day of the week. After all, we eat every day of the week. Stop looking for the closest parking spot to the gym, supermarket, or workplace. Walking is very easy and simple. You get up, you go, and you do. You see, you put one foot in front of the other, and along the way, you do your very best to enjoy it and create a new you. See you on the next video. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. Hi, it's Bill Loganiski, and I wanted to share with you uh, some great news. We've been working on creating a community website where you could come on and communicate with other people going through the same experience as you. Uh, you still go to the same address, it's joanbar.com or saturdaymorningdiet.com, and you can still get the free recipe. And what we want to do is extend it. All the YouTube videos are on the site. And what we want to do is make it available so you could come in and chat with other people going through the same experience and we could all share in what we're going through. You must pass this on. When someone shares something of value with you and you benefit from it, you have a moral obligation to share it with others. Please do. Please subscribe and come back soon. See you again. Thanks for watching. Hope you learned something new. Please subscribe, rate, comment, and share. Go to our website for free protein meal replacement recipe. Saturday Morning Diet, home of the Joan Bars. JoanBars.com or SaturdayMorningDiet.com. Thank you.